This girl is walking home after a night out and is intoxicated. A stranger pulls up in his car and talks to her. She tries to walk away. The stranger gets out of his car and gestures for the girl to get in. The man then walks around the car and attempts to get her into his car. Just as the strange man is about to get the girl into his car, a second man in a hut approaches. The man in the hat puts himself between the girl and the strange man. The man in the hat asks the girl if she knows their strange man, and she says no. The man in the hat makes the stranger troop back into his car. The men exchange more words. Finally, the stranger gets back into his vehicle. The strange man drifts off but threatens to turn. The man in the hat then tends to the girl. We hear Tayo screeching very loudly. He helps her to sit. He then goes to his care and retrieves something. The scary man drives by and yells that he's coming back. The man in the hat returns with a bottle of water. He asks her for her name, but she just smiles cautiously. The man then gets his cell phone out. He asks her information to try and help her. A few minutes pass. A car arrives. The man talks to the driver. It's a rideshare faith call to get their girl home safely. He helps the girl up and walks her to the car. He gets the door for her and gives her his bottle of water. He instructs the driver to get the girl safely to her front door. He gives the driver a cash tip. He shakes the driver's hand, thanks him, and waves bye to the girl. If you're wondering what happened to the girl and if she got them safe, well, I am that girl. I spent the following week looking on social media for the kind man that helped me. I eventually found the man and invited him out for coffee. And we've been together ever since.